guys, it's uh, day uh, four of 30 days of shadow. Um, I just did a quick makeup look. Well, I say quick, it's not quick. Um, I did a little bit more elaborate look today. Um, I'm wearing kind of a bright lip and a gold um, look on my eye, which I kept thinking to myself that it needed something else, but sometimes I just think I need like full on glitter on my eyes. And I know that that's not uh, a look you can wear every day. <laughs> So my foundation, well my primer that I put on my face was, um, I put the NYX face primer on my face and then I, well I forgot to bring it, and then the L'Oreal Magic Perfecting Base for a pore filler. I got these at Dollar Tree a while back and I still have some. Um, that's how much I've used. I don't use it all the time, but for a dollar from the Dollar Tree, these are kind of expensive even for like the bigger ones are like 10. And then I used um, my Revlon. <laughs> Let's see what this is. Photo Ready Instant Fix found Stick Foundation. Um, I was trying to do some contouring um, with a cream kind of foundation, and then my Tarte the Sculptor in shade one, and it kind of worked, but I'm still learning. Like I usually like to col uh, to contour with a powder, not a cream, but I was just trying to try it out. <laughs> um, and then I used to set my foundation the. CoverGirl and Olay powder I'm trying to use up in 310 Fair. And this is my progress. I'm still about the same. I want to see Pam. I'm sorry, guys. I really am trying to meet. And then my main palette I used today was the Lorac Unzip Palette. This is the original. I don't have the gold one. And um, these are the shades. Um, I did use a cream base. This is a cream base. And this is um, the Bomb Sh Be a Bombshell eye base and submissive it's kind of like a taupe gold color and then I used um, yeah I used this in my crease here it's called uh, undercover it's a matte shade in my crease and on my lid I used undercover and unreal together I mixed them together sometimes I do that and then in my inner corner and under my eye which this eye kind of looks like it has black under it, but it doesn't. Sometimes my camera just... I used um, the... In my inner corner, I used the L'Oreal Infallible Shade and Ice Latte. I've been loving this a lot. And then I used my NYX Brow Pencil and Taupe to uh, fill in my brows. I used my Shella Ivory Lace Highlighter to hi uh, kind of sculpt out my brows. And then I used my coveted e.l.f. Brow Gel to hold it in. I used a my Wet n Wild Fergie Center Stage Collection, which is this one in Holloway Boulevard, Holloway Hollywood Boulevard to highlight. This is the blush I used. I used NYX Been Tickled. It's a cream blush. It is the bomb. Like I love this. And then as soon as it, because I'm probably gonna replace it sooner or later, because it's kind of getting bad. And then this is the mascara I used. This is the Volumous Butterfly Intensa. Um, I don't know. I don't know how I feel about this. That's the wand. I don't know. I'm just really weird about mascara. And to set my matte, ma and I'm almost out of this one. I have to buy another one. NYX Matte Finishing Spray for my setting, my foundation. And then I have a Kat Von D um, lip color. I don't know what the lip color is. I'm sorry, guys. It kind of looks like red when you put it on, but it's like a deep pink. Um... That's what it looks like. I got it in like a sample from Sephora, so I really don't know what the color is. But that's my look today. I did upload a um, car vlog from yesterday. Please tell me how you feel about that. If you like it, if you don't, then that's fine. Whatever, I don't care. Um, it was from my phone, so it's not very long. But that is my look for today, and that's the fourth day on my 30-day shadow. And I will see you in my next video. Bye!